Now, you guys know I do not like Dana White. Do not like the UFC as an institution as a whole. But what he did today on ESPN First Take was anything other. You can't call it anything other than an execution. Um, Oscar De La Hoya needs to be very frightened uh, right now because I've said in the past that Oscar De La Hoya, I've messed with Oscar a lot about his sexual proclivities. Uh, the things that he does behind the scenes, um, how destructive he is toward when it comes to the fighters' finances, um, getting drunk, getting high, doing interviews. I, I said he was high when he did his interview on ESPN First Take, and he looked high. Um, but And Dana White came on air, ESPN, to it wasn't only a referendum on Oscar. He came on to as a referendum on ESPN First Take. ESPN First Take, whoever does their segments or creates the, the the lineup for their segments and how they structure their shows needs to actually pay attention to what people are saying online, okay? This was a bad look. Of all the looks that they consistently have on ESPN First Take, this was a bad look. First off, I don't know, I'm not the only person who said this. I know coaches said this. I know 78 has said this. I know a lot of other people have said this. Stop having Stephen A. Smith talk about mixed martial arts or boxing. He doesn't know a goddamn thing on the ins and outs of the business, A, the fighters, or what it takes to put together events. He doesn't. Okay, he, he, he has absolutely... Keep him in his strong suit. Basketball and you know, sucking up to the owners in the National Football League. That's it, okay? Stop having this guy comment on combat sports. He knows absolutely no one. He knows absolutely nothing. He doesn't actually be able to, he's never actually able to put and formulate his thoughts properly when it comes to explaining the things, the ins and outs of the business. And he got embarrassed today. He was resorted to stuttering and he didn't even know what he was. He just wanted to defend Oscar because he's paid to do so. And you really saw it. And um, this leads me into talking about uh, one other important individual that upsets me to no end. And that's Max Kellerman. Max Kellerman kept mispronouncing Richard Schaefer's name. He knows Richard Schaefer. Max Kellerman has said Richard Schaefer's name multiple times on, on actual broadcast telecast fights. And he kept disrespecting Richard Schaefer's name. And he kept disrespecting Richard Schaefer's name on purpose. He was doing it on purpose. There's no way you can... Just to disrespect to Richard Schaefer, because ESPN has a contract with Golden Boy. <sighs> Absolutely disgusting. This, this was a really bad black guy on ESPN First Take today. I'll leave a link in the description box. It's your boy, Quest X. I'm out.